Hey y'all, Jay Brick here, and welcome back to another The Super Mario Brothers movie review. In today's review, we're going to review The Mushroom Kingdom from Jack's Pacific, guys. I'm pretty excited to open up this box and show you guys what comes inside of it, but I'll show off the box a bit. Um, but I will go in deep with this box um, when we do show off the set, though, but this is the first part we're going to be unboxing it. So, let's go unbox it. So, we, we get the characters. That's pretty cool. I like them. They're in the little plastic um, box. Get the instruction to build up the castle. Um, and we got to put the box to the side. And we get the castle itself. And also, we do get some parts. So, we do have to go build this thing. So, yeah, that's basically everything that comes in the set. We get the castle. We get the little parts that we had to add on. And the characters. So I'm going to build this up. And in the next clip you guys will see the full build. And here is the set guys. Now I built this all up. And it looks really cool though. I do like how Peach's castle looks. It looks really cool though. We'll take a look at this first. And then we'll take a look at the characters. But this is Peach's castle with all the windows. It's a lot of windows. And even the door that opens. But there's nothing in there. It's just blank really. But it is pretty cool though that that still does open though. Then we have the glass piece from Mario 64. We do got some more flags up here that I do like. You know, I do like that because it does, you know, give off the vibe of Peach's Castle. And this does feel like Mario Odyssey, you know, if you because you know you get onto the castle or even Mario 64 though. So this castle does give me some nostalgia from those two games. But yeah, on the back though, I do like this though. This is from the poster that we got where Mario was on the ground looking towards the Peach's Castle and we got the hills. But that looks really cool though and I do like that a lot though on this though. But yeah, a pretty cool castle from the outside. Um, we'll take a look at the characters. So we got Princess Peach here. So we got Peach. She also moves her head so the characters do move their heads though and that's really cool. So we got that though on here. So we got Peach here. Then we got Mario. And Mario does also move his head, though, and that's really cool, though. So you can, like, basically pose him however you want, though. So that's really cool, you know, those little figures. And then we got the Piranha Plants robots, and you can see because they were in the training scene. And they look really cool, though, and basically, you know, you can move them. But it looks really cool, though. I do like them, how they do look. But yeah, guys, let's go open up the castle. I'm going to go take away the box and the figures. So we'll show off those inside of it, but basically you can just um, snap this open and there it is. Basically you're opened up the castle and I'll lay it towards there. But yeah, that's basically the entire castle inside. It looks really cool though. We do get some blocks, some question mark blocks, donut blocks, and we also got this block. You can see it also moves. So I do like that, you know, we got some little play features. Got some question mark blocks, more donut blocks. Then these blocks that open up and, you know, close back in. We also got a bullet bill. That's really cool, you know, he moves. We got some more donuts. And then we got a fireball, and, you know, you can see him right there. That's really cool, though. And then we got some more donuts and some more blocks and question mark blocks. But really cool, though. Also, we can add in the piranha, so we'll add one here. We'll open up the mouth so it does, you know, have an open mouth. And that looks really cool, though. And then we'll pose one um, on here. So in total, it looks really nice, though. You know, and you can also add Mario onto these blocks. So, you know, he's on off to an adventure. And, you know, wherever you want to put Peach, we'll just put her there. Because, you know, she's watching him do the obstacle course. But, man, this is a great set. Looks really cool, though. Get, um, you know, shows off more from the trailer, and I do like that, though. Now, also, you can shut off this, um, playset again, and I feel like, um, you can also add into these characters, so if you want to, um, keep these characters in there, because you can buy more sets, and I'll show you the box, where you can get more of the characters. But yeah, honestly, a really good, um, play features, and, you know, I do like that, um, bob -omb, you know, the, um the bill that they added um but yeah honestly a really nice castle where we you know where we get all from it even this one so 
Let's go take a look at the box. This is the front of the box. Shows us Mushroom Kingdom in, um, you know, in different languages. Um, and also the castle. Then shows us a little preview of what comes inside. You know, we got the Mario logo and Mario. On this side, it should show off, you know, the castle and all that. And then on the back, we do get the inside of it where, you know, it does show off the play features. And I do really like that though. And it, I do like how they added the fireball. Um, but yeah, this is basically all the characters that you could collect. There is Mario, Luigi, Peach, uh, Koopa, um, Kamek, and Toad, and also the van. And I do have the van, and that will be coming in a separate review. But I do like the back of the box. And then we got Mario on this side. But yeah, guys, this is a pretty cool set. And I do like the, um, the, the set, how it does look, though. But yeah, guys... That's going to have to do it for another review on the Super Mario Brothers toys. Don't forget, if you guys are new, to comment, like, and subscribe. It will truly help out a lot. We're trying to hit 900 subscribers. We're really close of hitting our goal, so make sure to sub to help us out, though. But yeah, guys, don't forget to also keep on those post notifications so you don't miss another review. But yeah, guys, that's going to have to do it, and I'll see you guys later. Peace.